This morning, Supreme Court Justice Samuel Alito is facing mounting scrutiny. A report by the New York Times claimed a stop the steal symbol used by election deniers was on display outside the justice's home just days after the January 6th attack. Scott McFarlane has more on how Justice Alito is responding. There are calls for Justice Samuel Alito to recuse himself from any cases involving the 2020 election after the New York Times published this photo of an upside down American flag flying outside Alito's home in the days after the January 6th assault on the U.S. Capitol. The flag upside down became a symbol of the Stop the Steal movement used by rioters and election deniers after the 2020 vote. This is a member of the Supreme Court. You know, people around the world are looking to them to be uh, unbiased. In a statement, Alito told the New York Times, I had no involvement whatsoever in the flying of the flag. It was briefly placed by Mrs. Alito in response to a neighbor's use of objectionable and personally insulting language on yard signs. Neighbors told the paper Alito's wife was involved in a dispute with another family who'd put an anti-Trump sign on their lawn. At the time, the high court was considering 2020 election challenges and now is weighing critical cases involving Donald Trump, including whether the former president is immune from prosecution for efforts to subvert the election. Alito, who has recently argued free speech is under attack. Troubled waters are slamming against some of our most fundamental principles was scrutinized last year when a report showed he'd gone on a luxury fishing trip to Alaska, paid for by two Republican donors, one of whom had cases before the court. Alito said they never discussed business. Alito's fellow justice Clarence Thomas also faced scrutiny after it was revealed his wife Ginny sent text messages to former White House Chief of Staff Mark Meadows, challenging the 2020 election results. The Supreme Court Code of Conduct says justices should not be swayed by partisan interests and should remain dignified and respectful. For CBS Saturday Morning, Scott McFarland, The Supreme Court.